there we go it is that time again welcome this is i am we are the kumask the kumask crew and everything in between uh it is time for our next loot crate opening and review and i've got it right here it actually came in the mail yesterday which is really weird the last one i uh did the review on and opened up we got the shirt from i guess i'm just always going to wear the shirt from the last box every time i do a review now uh, or open the new one up, but yeah, it was weird because we got the last one like a week ago And then we just got this one. I just got this one yesterday. So anyway Here we go. Let me get the boot knife. I got it always started out last time. I had it open in my hand ready to go <clears throat> so Cutting that bad boy And this is a I've noticed that all the all the every month like they're different sizes the boxes are always different sizes I don't know I guess they just make them make them for uh the particular thing you are getting here we go opening it up looks like some bricks bricks in here I'm not really sure what this is it looks like it might be a coin bank because it looks like you would cut this out or something anyway uh, do not know the theme of this one but we got this right on top so we'll go ahead and open this up first uh, I will show the poster and it looks to be a Zelda poster which is amazing I'm not gonna show the back of this uh, so I don't spoil it for you guys brah Hold up. I, I spoiled something for myself. But anyway, got a big old Legend of Zelda a Breath of the Wild poster. Boom. There you go. And on the back, it has all the contents of the box in there. I'll try to keep that hidden. And try to fold this back up. And we'll read that stuff later. Anyway, first things first. We got the shirt. Boom. It is Middle Earth. Shadow of War, Loot Crate exclusive, ballin'. I love Lord of the Rings, huge fan. I've loved it since, uh, I guess since I saw the first the first movie I saw, I was like in a middle school maybe. I don't know. I don't know how old it was. But anyway, I've liked it since then. I have not played this game. Uh, the last Lord of the Rings game I played was honestly like the first one <laughs> on PlayStation, I think. Anyway, so yes, I did change my size because, like I said last time, uh, shirts. Always order, if you're going to get a Loot Crate box, order a shirt one size larger than you. I wear large. This is a large, but I have since the last video, literally like that day or the day after, I went on the website and changed them to extra larges. Uh, because they shrink. This is this is shrunk. Uh, from one wash. Uh, but if you're going to sit there and only do cold washes, then I guess it didn't really matter. But just be on the safe side. Always get one size larger. I can't speak for women's clothes. I would assume it's the same material, same... Uh, yeah, same material, same shirt, basically, for women's. Uh, but always get one size more. It's 90% cotton, 10% polyester. It shrinks. Anyway, we got that. I don't know what this is, but this looks sick. Okay, next up, we'll just put this back in here. It looks like a little notebook? I, I'm i not sure. And that's that looks like a... I could... Man, I really don't want to be wrong here, but like a Majora's Mask kind of thing? I don't know. I might be horribly mistaken. But anyway, this this is weird. This is like a little notebook. Look, check it out. So, and it's a little, it's like got a glossy uh, finish on there, so it's kind of reflective. But anyway, yeah, it's a little notebook thing. I don't know why there's like a handle. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. I don't know if that's something from a game, but it actually doesn't have anything on here saying, hey, what game it's from. That does look like a Majora's Mask emblem though. Uh, there is a little bit of damage right up here. I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's like a real thick cardboard backing. And it is it is damaged. Just just a little bit. Uh, I don't know if we can zoom in on it. It's not... There you go. You can see, like... I don't know if it's going to focus in on that necessarily, but... It's like a couple layers of the cardboard would peel off, or like that uh, actual picture that's been applied to it would. Anyway, that's pretty neat. Uh, it's a one-time use thing. I don't think you can refill this at all. It's just like, hey, do it. Draw little pictures. Make a flip book. There you go. <laughs> I mean, what else do you do? I don't know. What else do you do? Anyway, next up. Okay, cool. Uh, this is The Witcher Wild Hunt. Uh, whoops, let me move this. I don't know why it's... There we go. Okay. Ooh. Bra. Okay, this is for drinkers. The drinkers. I I drink. I'm a drinker. This is actually a wine bottle top, a cork per se, a wine stopper. 
to be more accurate. That's pretty sick. I guess you could use it for maybe like a bottle of Jaeger too, because that's about the same size hole. I don't think you could put that in much else, especially nothing that's a... Uh, you could put it in a bottle of Jaeger, I know that. I don't think you could, I don't know. Anyway, it's a wine stopper, so that's pretty neat. Give you a little closer look on there. See if I can get it to actually focus in on it. I may not be able to. There you go, there you go. Pretty sick. Hey, ballin'. That's pretty neat. I like it. It's very heavy. This is this is probably I haven't opened anything else other than what I have opened, but this is very high quality. Usually they are very high quality anyway. Uh, so this is pretty cool. This will probably be my favorite thing out of this box as of right now. As of right now it is. That's pretty neat. <clears throat> On the back it says, wash in warm soapy water, not dishwasher safe. Uh, the Witcher game is based on the prose, prose of Andrzej Sapkowski. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. I don't know what the point of that is on the back of here. Uh, but anyway, here's our pin. Oh, and by the way, I put, where is it? I got the one from last time on here. The one from uh, two months ago was a, a bottle cap from Ballout. I can't put that on the hat. It'll, it, like, because it's, I just can't. Uh, but this one, Elder Scrolls Skyrim. I would know this emblem anywhere. Man, the, the freaking, the the, sh the shine. Let me just, I'm going to open this up. It's going on my hat, like, immediately, so. Um, this is cool. And I think that's, now that I'm, this is my third Loot Crate uh, gaming box. I, I don't know if every single Loot Crate box comes with a pen. But I kind of have the impression that they do. It, that for sure, the Loot Crate gaming ones do. And that's, like, their monthly monthly pen, I guess. Mon monthly, like, you get one thing that's the same, quote, the same every month, but different. This is it. Elder Scrolls Skyrim. Oh, and it says, Praise be Akatosh. Akatosh, sorry. Praise be Akatosh and all the divines. Pretty sick. I like this a lot. Oh, okay. And there you go. On the pen it says this uh, theme was Fortress. Fortress, August 2017. <laughs> Excuse me. Boom. I'll do one more frontal view there. I'm going to put on my hat right now, though. Hell yeah. Very heavy duty. Just like the last one. It is going to go... It is going to go right beside it. I'm digging this. <clears throat> I will say, I like these more than that Fallout one uh, from two months ago. Reason... I love Fallout. Don't get me wrong. But reason being is because that literally is a bottle cap. And... How do I explain it? Like, the, it doesn't have that fancy thick pen with the the backs like this. You know, I just showed the, where it has the one metal pen. It is it is one of those, like, baby pen safety pen latches on that uh, bottle cap one. So it will not go on a hat. You will end up bending it or breaking it or something. I don't know what you put that on. Maybe an apron. I could, I could see you putting on an apron if you're, like, a chef or you want to cook out and show off that. Anyway, looks like the final thing we have in this box is a huge and heavy like statue almost it's the figure but this thing is huge and i will show up the i will uh, pick up the uh, two from the last two months and show you all them in comparison this box is huge it is heavy it is it is heavy let me find a little knife here real quick mm, yeah there we go there we go there we go probably gonna be more too Ooh, Ooh, come on now come on there we go oh that's a satisfying noise mm. all right uh, by the way, let me show the front real quick before I just, like, get in here. The glare, man. It's very sunny out. I have the drapes closed. I'm kind of... I guess that's what's going on. Maybe I decided to stream too, uh... Too late. I don't know what's happening here. Because that's usually not an issue. Anyway, on the back it says Loot Gaming. High Dragon. Each century, the skies of Thetis... Thetis. Darken as a High Dragon. The oldest and rarest of their kind. Takes wing. Join legendary heroes and lead the Inquisition against the forces of chaos. Dragon Age Inquisition. Loot crate screenshots. I don't know what that is. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. All right. Setting that down. It is all up in here. I don't want this to break. 
looks pretty cool so far. We'll get a closer look when I get all this uh, wrapping off. Let me uh, untie this. It's got one real thick, one of those metal wires that are wrapped in plastic, like a twist tie, but a more heavy duty twist tie. Keeping it held into place there, one little piece of plastic that was taped to the box. Uh, these always make me so nervous opening up, for real. Oh god. And this horns. I'm worried about the horns. Let me try to get this out. Okay. Alright, alright. Cool. It's all in there. A little piece of plastic over the wings. I kind of, I'm just waiting for this guy to just do that number. Because he, he, he looks like he's about to pounce. trying to like focus on my hat I think there we go so the dragon's just chilling grabbing the rock do the backside uh, by the way the wings the wings I mean it's it's very hard plastic uh, the horns a little bit it'll, it'll break if you drop this thing it's gonna break into a bunch of pieces if it, it feels I don't know what it's made out of it didn't tell you. But definitely something you want to take care of and not drop. Is it feels it feels strong enough to survive just sitting somewhere, but I wouldn't try to bend these at all. And the tail, there's three spines on the tail that might break off sort of easily. And those horns though. Anyway, that's pretty sick. That's gonna go out of here. By the way, let me do that comparison real quick. Uh, from the last two. This was the statue or the figure from last month This is the figure from this month. It's actually surprisingly like the same uh, All kind of the same size per se But this this is like a solid piece right here. This rock is definitely solid. I don't think it's hollow at all So there's that one and then here's the figure from uh, Two months ago So, yeah, like that. This is definitely the biggest one I've gotten so far. Anyway, just a little bit of comparison there for you. I love dragons. Who doesn't like dragons? So, this is my new favorite statue. It was this guy. <laughs> He's still going to chill there. They're all going to chill here until there's literally no room for me to have any more statues here. Okay, so we got the shirt. That is everything in the box so far, or this month. Uh, then we got the box. I don't know what the box is supposed to, oh wait, hang on. Oh, there is something weird on here. Okay, let me try to figure this out. We will put this bad boy together. That is that is it for all the contents of the uh, crate itself. But let me go ahead and take this box apart. Mm, there we go. It's always fun. Should be an expert right now, right? Only done three of these. Or two. This being the third. But I am not. No way. It's very a very awkward thing to do. <laughs> it's not hard though. Because they all break apart. They all yeah, I guess break apart and fold back the same way. I have no idea what this box is going to do. Alright. And this is not, I don't think this is from any game or anything, it just, it clearly says loot gaming on the front of this. Uh, there we go, there we go. Boom. I don't know what this is supposed to be. But, a couple of weird things, there's actually two perforations on the bottom. And then one really big preparation on the top, and I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Besides punch it out. And there's one on the side, too. Uh, okay. Let's look. I, I don't want to take it apart. I think I want to keep them solid. But let me go ahead and open up this and show everything that is on here. And maybe it'll tell us what the box is going to do or supposed to do. I don't know. All right. 
Oh, okay. This this is not a. I don't know why I was thinking uh, Legend of Zelda. What I say? Majora's Mask. I don't know why I was associating that with Majora's Mask. This is Legend of Zelda: Breath of the Wild, Sheikah Slate Notebook. In the Legend of Zelda series, the Sheikah are a race of warriors who guard the royal family of Hyrule. There are Sheikah in uh, Ocarina of Time and the other one I keep forgetting the freaking name of that I just said numerous times. Anyway, so maybe that's why I associated that. It says, the Sheikah Slate was created to help Link fight Calamity Ganon. In other words, it's pretty important to Link's quest to take back the castle and save Hyrule. Uh, we designed this notebook based on the in-game model, and you can use it to record your life, your real-life adventures, just like the Slate records Link's adventures in Breath of the Wild. I don't have that game. I don't have a Switch, so I don't have that. <laughs> Otherwise, I probably would have understood it, but you know what? Maybe that would explain the handle. I don't know that personally, but there you go. I would assume he, like, pulls it out and, I don't know, maybe that's how you save your game or something. I don't know. Then we got, and we got the Skyrim coin pin. Skyrim will be released for Nintendo Switch later this year. Cool. Uh, take a coin from the world of Skyrim and buy yourself something nice, like a chicken. So you won't have to steal it, and the guards won't hunt you for the rest of your days. Then we got the Dragon Age Inquisition High Dragon figure. And the game, The Return of the High Dragons, is what transitioned the Blessed Age into the Dragon Age. We got the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Bottle Stopper. Uh, the School of the Wolf isn't the only Witcher order. Others include Cat, Bear, Griffin, Viper, and Manticore. We got the Middle Middle Earth Shadow of War T-shirt, and the Dark Tongue of Mordor. Nazgul literally means Ring Wraith, and that's a picture of the Ring Wraith on there. Pretty sick. Uh, and one lucky winner of a box somewhere, lucky lucky person, whoever you are, got the Skyrim PSVR Epic Drop. Ep PSVR Epic Drop. One lucky winner gets a PlayStation 4 Pro, one terabyte console, a PlayStation VR launch bundle, and the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim VR for PlayStation 4. Ridiculous. What is this? Uh, bonus DLC, Pinball FX2. Want to battle your way through menacing hordes of Vikings or take on a crooked gang of outlaws in Old West? You can do that and more in Iron and Steel Pack, an exciting pinball table 2 pack that combines Zen's own epic medieval adventure, Castle Storm with Wild West Rampage where you can play a Cindy, a Tough as Nails Frontier, Bounty Hunter in the Old West. Barge into a world of dragons and trains, swords and six shooters, the perfect blend of the Middle Ages and the Wild West. Look for an email to the address associated with your account for redemption instructions. Pinball FX2 sold separately, Windows OS ca capable, PC required. Oh, okay. Because I thought, I thought the box was like empty of one thing. It felt like it was missing one thing, but apparently... Uh... It's just, they're just gonna email you part of it. Weird. <laughs> That's pretty weird, not even gonna lie. Anyway, one last time, that was the Fortress, uh, Fortress box for this month, uh, or August or September, I don't know. A new ring has been forged, a hero has been reborn, it's time to kill some monsters, no fortress can withstand your might when you have powerful artifacts from Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, The Witcher 3, Wild Hunt, Middle Earth, Shadow of War, and Dragon Age Inquisition. Well, that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Tune in next month, I suppose, maybe even sooner. It depends on when the box gets here. For the next Loot Crate Gaming review, this thing's cool. I want to know what the hell this box is supposed to do. I feel like it's supposed to be a coin bank, but this literally is just a huge thing that pops out. Not going to do it, though. Anyway, there you go. Hope you had a good time with me, the Kumosk. Tune in to twitch.tv slash the Kumosk anytime. Uh... Anytime, drop a follow, whatever you want to do. Thank you again, Loot Crate Gaming, for or Loot Crate yourself, for supplying this marvelous, marvelous product. I love the things you guys do. Thank you very much, everybody. Have a good night.